hello beautiful people welcome to global happenings today youtube channel right now osho state is our gog osho things are happening there don't forget that the governorship elections will be taking place anytime soon and the big weights are already in town you know the last one that was held in ikiti was almost a home run for abola ahmed tunabu where most of the um oppositions were not there and labor party was not ably represented by their leader that was when uh, peter obi went for the study of um, electrification power that took place in egypt Therefore, whatever reasons, I think they had one or two scores, but they were unable to, uh, PDP was unable to do something really strong. They had internal scrubbers, really. But as we speak, all the power guns are there. Uh, for Peter Obi had been there earlier on, when Atiku Abubakar himself, and um, a, a do state governor, that's God, God, Godwin Obaseki, is there. He's um, the... Atiku's deputy, uh, presidential, uh, vice presidential aspirant, that's Okoa from Delta State, was also their life. But of course, the big one was Miss and your governor, your son, Wiki. Then, in this whole matter, you would also notice that the likes of <laughs> the likes of Fireshe, Isaac Fireshe, was busy mocking the living daylight out of PDP, saying, go ahead, go. You may need to come back later and beg governor, your son, Wiki. Because honestly, Governor Yusuf Wiki have a way around some of these campaign things. But what unique thing about this whole campaign that we all hope that it doesn't turn foul lines, like some persons would call it, um, is the fact that uh, celebrities, musicians, uh, some for the for uh, those who love uh, the, the the street kind of songs, while some who like it in, in a polished manner. All manner of uh, musicians, uh, entertainers, are their life routine differently. But what hurts me the most is the fact that they're probably rooting for the wrong reason. For the likes of those who like the streets, the streets kind of song, uh, the Nigerian streets kind of song, portable, who have over time, calling the Zazu Krona, who have over time have gotten to be followed and liked by most Nigerians who love the street life, Nigerian street life. He seemed to have come out clean, said, look, some, some time ago, they paid him to insult Bola Ahmed to the book. So right now, APC have paid him and he must do the job. So he came into a show state and, uh, in a grand style at the Zazu Krona Portable Omo Laolomi storms Oshogbo State Capital of Oshun to solid seat vote for Governor Adegbo Yega Oyetola re election bid. But the shocking part, we hope, and honestly, we do hope that it doesn't turn, uh, turn out badly, is the fact that David Doe himself, I'm talking about OBO himself is there live and he's wearing the pdp uh clothes um, so the the local um attire traditional attire of the eurobus agbada 1500 you know and he wrote on his on the on, on the cloth on the chest he wrote there imole local and imole happened to be his relative now really for the video is about blood all right, it's about his family. He believes that um, <laughs> Adeleke has paid the dues and he ought to become the governor of the state. All right, there was a lot of um, cheering here and there. For Zazu, it's not about Nigerians. It's not about um, who's the, who ought to, or who changed the narrative for good. It's not about good governors. It's about they paid me, I must deliver. Have you not seen that our suffering, uh, our suffering, no, they do. Even when we were, I was saying this some, some, some time ago, that whether we like it or yes, whether you're an elite, your vote is won. That young man on the street pushing barrow, his vote also is the same as yours. One. So you got to give as much education as you can. If you want a better change, that barrel pusher may not really see the change you're talking about because honestly, it's not thinking beyond his meal ticket. All he's thinking of is, what do I need to eat? Now, if you're going to give him something bigger than his meal ticket, 
tell me what you want me to do, I'll do it sharp, sharp. Because that's what poverty has done to Nigerians. And our politicians know this. And that's why when they realize that the elites now know, the common Nigerians who have gone through the four walls of the university, who have been one way or the other been exposed to better life, or who have one way or the other understand their rights as Nigerians, they will probably not push too hard because they now know that, oh, when I'm a don't reach, you don't do. Let's look for those who their mumu never reach or we never do. So they may likely go into the suburbs, you know, but now a lot of people are scared right now. Why they're scared is very simple. Everywhere Zazu, as everywhere where Zazu uh, does any form of um, program and show, there's always a break up, a, a breakout. And a lot of people are just hoping and praying uh, that um, Zazu at least respects a senior colleague. I don't know if Zazu knows what respect is on that count because he just had to deliver. Uh, but a lot of people are wondering, with the big guns in the house, PDP in their full numbers, uh, Diri is there, that's by a state governor, uh, Do is there, um, uh, Delta is there, even the big man himself, I'm talking about Tiko Abubakar, is also there. And uh, for the first time, which is a new comment into the field, field. A lot of Nigerians are also appreciating him a great deal, even though the crowd was not too big compared to PDP and APC. I'm talking about Peter Obi. A lot of people appreciated the fact that he came there to show them love. You just know that this guy is, is unique. He's soft. Now you now understand why, since he's soft and unique, you now understand why his followers needed to aggressively push because this man is very soft. When they said uh, those people, they went to Nubu Bala Akma, to Nubu, said the laborers, they will labor and die. They will labor in vain and die. He said, to, when they show you hate, show them love. That can only come from someone whose heart is soft. And uh, our Nigerian politics is a hard game. It takes the wrong get. Eh? The Europeans call it Awala Yaki. Eh? Oh, God, she just preserved this Peter B for us. It is well. But right now, I guess it's about um, uh, is the uh, uh, for the money at the Adele case are equal to the tax. Mm. Uh, when I say they are, they are equal, uh, uh, OBO here is not doing badly, and his uncle is not doing badly as well. And don't forget that uh, APC too <laughs> is a party of Orumo uh, led them. They are complete there, but let's say it plays out eventually. Well, let's see how this whole thing plays out. I wish the very best. I wish them all the very best. But I do know one thing for certain. Unfortunately, uh, I do not think that the uh, the Labour Party uh, uh, governorship aspirant may be able to do much simply because um, when it comes to the issue of Labour Party, most Nigerians know Peter Obi. So I believe that um, the Labour Party governorship candidate ought to have done his grassroots work a long time and that delegates family have been known really to make a lot of um you know awareness program before now that's what we're going to wrap it up let's put in our conversation also take